Your head, she know my teeth. You know what I'm saying? You're on here because uh, you want to hear my stripper stories. Retired stripper, okay? Here we go. I did meet some some famous people. Some of them are more famous than others. <laughs> a guy was in a tracksuit, an 80s tracksuit, and he was an asshole. I have thick skin from being in the military, plus I give a fuck whether they like me or not because there's 16 other girls on the day shift. They can pick out whoever goddamn chick they want, and if they don't like me, well, Stop fucking talking to me and wasting my time. I think I was bored that day. And so he was sitting at the bar with some older gentleman, but I was being a spitfire and he was spitting him right back. And we were like, go back and forth. And I was enthralled that he was being such a dick and I didn't want him to get one over on me. So I stayed there and entertained that. You know, I come to Vegas all the time and I don't think that you necessarily know. $100 bill. Who you are talking to. Uh, another hundred dollar bill. And I think if you knew who I was. Another hundred dollar bill. And places them on his leg like this, right? Cause he kept saying, ask the bartender, ask the bartender who I am. I don't care if you're Missy fucking Elliot walking in here, throwing down hundred dollar bills across your lap. If you're an asshole, you're an asshole and I'm not trying to dance for you. I said, if you are not interested in me dancing for you, you let me know which other girl, I will go get her for you as a courtesy. After he left, I asked the bartender who he was. She said he's an Olympic swimming gold medalist. <laughs> it's like, I don't give a fuck. Anticlimactic. Not one of the newer ones because I was a stripper when I was 26. One of the older ones. Show. <laughs> I don't give a fuck.